Now, where we left off, I was going through my first hour and or so. So, um, yeah, this time, I, I was talking about how I felt like the kitchen was a safe haven because no one was really going in there. And then as I was saying that, a couple of attempts later, somebody was finally smart enough to flick the switch in the kitchen as I was in there with the girl. And I was hoping to God that I was staring at her, but I don't think it really matters anymore. Luckily, thanks to that, um, I can say is, um, I caught you, you slime a little, oh, you caught you, I throw it. Like the last episode, it was still funny, so. As long as they don't turn off the lights, I'll be fine. Still funny. Damn it. <laughs> Wait. Oh, Jesus. That was quick. I have not seen her do that yet. Uh, I can't crowd either, so I can't look at her, at her face. It's a little dumb. But, anyway. Um. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, where we left off, like I said, going through this first hour, because I survived the easy hour, which is you just look around and see what's <laughs> up. Man, she's a lot more active than the last time. The thing is, it's the same hour. It's like, boop, 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 boop. It's a matter of time before she can get me, though, seriously. It's also a matter of time before somebody actually turns off the lights. Like, seriously, one flick of the switch and I'm screwed. That's usually what ended me. That, well, not that's usually. That is what ended me. Was they turned off the switch on me and I was stuck in there like crap. Um, so as I, pro I'm pretty sure I said this in the last episode. Um... Low res, unfortunately, is the only one that works for me while I'm recording and still be able to play the game. Because otherwise... No. 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 No, no. no. There we are. Oh, thank God. Um, orig originally, uh, probably changing the subject. Um, but... Oh yeah, no, I'm gonna finish the one subject. Basically, um, with my recorder, usually the frame rates are about the same, but there are those other games that do take um, a good portion of my frames away when I'm recording, just because how much it takes to record it. But in return, you guys get to see it how I would usually play it. So like, for example, I may be playing the game right now in like 30 frames, because it's done low. But you guys would probably see this as a good 60 frames. And if not, I blame my video editor because it has a history of doing that. Where I have a game running at full 60 frames and it never records at full 60 frames. Um. No! Back away! No, no. Oh! Oh, thank God! That was so close. Oh, man. They turned off the lights while I was in the middle of it, and I heard her laugh like, No, no, no. Okay. But anyway. Um, yeah, we're good for now. Um, yeah, basically, this game... I gotta get a new graphics card, basically. Mine's getting old. Uh, a lot of the stuff is harder to run now, of course, because the next gen as well just doesn't help. Um... Because I got this in 2013 when PS4 and Xbox One were just coming out. So all the next-gen stuff was all still pretty bland. Everything was still working. And now that it, we're a few years into it, my, you know, we, of course, the uh, g graphics card that I have in here still runs like a PS3 pretty much. A little better than a PS3. So, yeah, I, I gotta get a new graphics card. And like I said, this was an office <laughs> desktop. No! Where are you? 
got you. I gotta get a new graphics card for this desktop. And then also I gotta get a new Elgato. Because I got the Elgato the Christmas 2014, but unfortunately what happened was that exact year it came with the Elgato 60, which now runs the games in 60 frames. So realizing this, I have a 30 frame recorder for my consoles. So that explains why the console games are usually not the 60 frames they deserve to be. So I do plan on getting Elgato 60 and f eventually fixing that. I also need a uh, pop filter for my microphone. Yes, I've had this Lenovo. No, not the Lenovo. This mic is not a Lenovo. My laptop's a Lenovo. Anyway, um, eh, I have a laptop too. <laughs> but I can't use it because I don't have a license to. Oh, caught ya, whore. Got you now. What are you going to do? That's right. Um, yeah, I have a Lenovo that's. Oh, Jesus! Everything went dark. I'm like, no! <laughs> What the? No, it is not him. It's her. Is that her? Yeah, it is. Good. Good. It's her again. It's not that dummy yet. Um. Which I guess that makes it a lot easier for me because I already know how to deal with her. And I mean, if that's gonna be the case. work damn it there we go that was like a real struggle mm-hmm I know your games you ain't gonna get me in the darkness unless you turn off this light then I'm pretty much screwed because I think the, uh, no, there's the one more It got really quiet. I don't like it when horror games go. So I guess I'm already dealing with two. Fantastic. I just love already dealing with two before I introduce to any of them. Uh, with the exception. <laughs> Where is she? I can tell she's some. There you are! It's been so long since I've seen you. Please don't turn off the lights. That'd be great. Oh my god. I didn't expect the clown to already be here, especially with her here. I didn't expect to already deal with two. Like, now I'm really glad that I had done a little bit of research into the game before I played, because I would have been jumped again. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. I would not have been good. Don't stay still. I'm not a liar. It's just me. Nope, 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 
words of Josh 2016. Being stuck's never good. Write that down. Make that a quote. Make that quote of the year. Unless I say something better. And then I'll tell you to make that quote of the year. But for now, the quote of the year is being stuck in things. <laughs> nope. Controls are not in my favor. If you could hear me like button mash E trying to turn on the switch and it'll never go on. It's like, mm. I got all the lights back on, thank God. Because oh, you better not turn off that light. No, okay, she, somebody keeps turning off the lights. I bet you it's <laughs> from Chester I run from Chester One ginormous room. So, yeah. I heard him. I was so terrified. I was like, is he in the room I just walked into? Okay, usually when the door closes, I probably. I'm a little fucker. Hey, <laughs> clown guy, how you doing? <laughs> Okay. I could do this. I could easily do this. This game is possible. And if it's possible, yes, I'm pretty sure it's possible. I know, I don't know. Um, there are some horror games that okay. Ori originally, this channel was supposed to be a game, uh, like a, another channel with another, like another pile of horror game series. I don't know, because um, when I did Outlast, it was a kick. So. <laughs> Unfortunately, I think I've lost the videos. I think they're gone. I don't think I'll be able to put them up. But I did Outlast and uh, the Whistleblower DLCs. Maybe by the time Outlast 2 comes out, because I did hear that it was announced, um, maybe I'll do a Let's Play of that, because I really did like the first one enough to buy the DLC and that was my very first um no, actually no there was slender I did slender as a, as a kid back in 2016 um 
2000. Wow. Can't 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 speak. Has dumb. How? What year is it now? 2019. Is that when we're finally getting Five Nights at Freddy's? And what about 2020? Is this when we're now playing Emily once? Uh, I don't know. Um. No, originally this channel, after, you know, my success, success of having that with my friends on Facebook, they all loved it. With the success of that, um, that's what led me to, you know, start working on getting a channel on YouTube running. And speaking of running, oddly enough, we have not seen Chester or any of those three for quite a bit. We've just been wandering around this room. I'm not going to complain. It's a good thing. Uh, yeah, no, um, what else, there, yeah, basically, I know you guys, I, I don't know if you guys even commented or if I even told the story, but I'll basically tell the story now, just in case if I haven't, um, when I first got the PS3, it was back in Christmas 2013, it's also... Uh, the same year I got my PC and as well as my three Xbox 360 because I was slow. Um, basically, I spent my money on 360 and PC um, because what happened? What happened? Um, with this channel, it all started back in I'd say 2011. Um, Slender was a big craze as well as Modern Warfare 3. And I didn't know about Slender until I was playing Modern Warfare 3 with a few guys. And my sister showed me this guy named PewDiePie, um, who is now the number one most subscribed guy on YouTube. Um, and she showed me one of his montage videos of Amnesia. So I thought that was funny. And then I was hearing some guys talk about him playing Slender, um, which made me watch it. And then it led to me to... Um, watching more of his videos, more on his channel, and then I realized that, hey, a lot of people could be doing this, and little did I know, people were. People were starting to do it, and it's all thanks to PewDiePie. Because, to be honest, there were videos that did it before him, but none of them were seen the same way. No, no one saw it as a comedic value. Everyone just saw it as a, like, a free like, guide to beat a game, like, a, a walkthrough, basically, um, so everyone started doing it as, like, I, as the years went by, um, I started watching his, I thought he was really funny, and I realized that I could do that if I wanted to, or I wish I could, so, you know, it, it, I was just playing games, thinking that'd be really cool, oh, thank god, started watching uh, Markiplier, and then I realized that there are all sorts of different things. It wasn't just beauty pie, it was all sorts of different things. I didn't know who, I didn't hear who it was, but I think it's the little girl. Um, but no, I started to realize that um, just about anyone can do it. Because everyone, I guess, started realizing that at that point. Like, oh, there was all these other people doing it. And I think that was the year or it was the following year, 2013, where the Game Grumps started to come around. And that's when they really boosted up. Showing that it wasn't just these guys screaming on videos of horror games. It could be any game. No, 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 no. Um. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I hate 
hate them so much. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, 2012 and 2013 when the, the gaming um let's play community started. To <laughs> saying the, the community got really big um people started to realize that it was actually a pretty easy thing to do a lot of people actually didn't realize that you didn't need to <laughs> truly edit to do this it's a pretty simple thing to do um so a lot of people started doing it and then i was like you know what i'm gonna start doing it and actually it was back in 2012 when i realized there was more than just <laughs> doing it um, I don't like this. Ah! Uh, turn on the lights. I didn't know she was behind. I should have known she was behind me. Duh. Looking that way, wasn't I? I don't know. Um, guess I'll continue the story later. Alright, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs>